whenever we have a cash flow load, we don't get much out of the things. In order to get the maximum, we have to have a very sincere growth. So when we looked at the queue, in the first world was a cash flow look only, and many came with an answer 16, 17. Then later on, few people thought, so they reached a little closer, and they said 26, 27, 28. And the right answer is 30. Second message is, many times in life, we have got so many things within us. We have got so many qualities, we have got so many traits, but we require somebody else to tell us that you have this. So I can say that right now in this hall, in this auditorium, we have got somewhere 200 Hanuman sitting. How many? You know what was special about Hanuman? He had a lot of qualities inside him, but every time he used to forget. And at the time, the qualities were needed, he required somebody else to tell that Hanumanji you can do this. Are you with me? Yes. So you all Hanumans are sitting here and I am doing the job of telling you that you have got so many qualities within you. So my job is just to let you know that there is potential inside you. My job is just to let you know that there is a huge confidence inside you. So I welcome all Hanuman sitting here and say Jo say Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram. Jai Shri Ram. Dynamic personality. He is really impressing people like anything and I want to be like him. So what is it which you see in that person which you want to have in your soul? Would anybody tell me what are the few ingredients which you believe a person must have if he or she is looking forward to have a very good personality? If I ever go to a person, I should be able to talk to him, whether it is an interview or a stage or anything, I should be able to communicate very well. If I say all these qualities, all these qualities, not one, two or three, I am saying all these qualities once upon a time were in everybody sitting here. I repeat, these sari qualities which I have told you, I am saying all these qualities which I have told you, these are all good. एक वक्त मैं आप सबके भीतर थे। I repeat थे है नहीं। तो आज जाइए से थे। अभी है नहीं। उस होने का ही कार्यक्रम चल रहा है। जब उन्होंने तुम्हें बनाकर भेजा, तो तुम क्या किया? इसको यूँ समझो कि when you want to go to the birthday of somebody, someone who is very close to you, somebody whom you love the most, somebody who is very close to you, someone whom you love the most, तो आप मार्केट में जाते हैं गिफ्ट खरीदने के लिए and you try your best. Go for the best gift because you love him the most. And before packing that gift, you make it sure that everything is okay. Next day, you don't have any damage. You feel fresh. And then you best wrap it and then you give it. Yes or no? Yes. Yeah. Normally, if there is no love, you pass the gift to the old one. But this is the example where somebody is very close to so you. You you love him the most. So the upper one is the one who loves you the most. जब तुम्हारा ये गिफ्ट पैक किया, तो वो गलती कैसे कर सकते? If I want to be confident, what shall I do? He said, before you decide to be confident, you need to understand the type of confidence. And then you tell me what kind of confidence are you looking for? I said I want a confidence which should remain in me all the time, every time, whenever it is needed. So he said, you need to understand the types of confidence first of all. And if you do not work on these skills, that confidence will not come. You may be very good with maths, you may be very good with physics, you may be very good with English, but if you do not know how to teach effectively, then though your English knowledge is good, though your maths knowledge is good, but the moment you get into the class, you will just under, won't understand that what is happening. My subject is good, yet I am not able to impress the people. The only problem with you is, you do not have <laughs> a construction site to make worker. Maybe you have to go site the site and work on तो मंडे को अपनी साइट पर गया और लंच टाइम हुआ तो उसने लंच में अपना टिफिन बाहर निकाला और जब टिफिन खोला तो उसने सैंडविच था उसने सैंडविच को खाया फिर ट्यूसडे आया ट्यूसडे को वो दोबारा अपनी साइट पर गया ट्यूसडे को उसने लंच खोला दोबारा उसने क्या निकला सैंडविच इज अरो माय गॉड अगेन सैंडविच बट समहाउ ही एट इट बिकॉज़ ही वाज हंगरी ऑन वेंसडे ही वेंट टू द कंस्ट्रक्शन साइट ही ओपन हिज लंच बॉक्स एंड अगेन निकला सैंडविच इज अरो नो दिस इज एनफ नाउ अगेन सैंडविच बट ही समहाउ ही एट एंड देन केम थर्सडे लंच टाइम हुआ उसने फिर टिफिन खोला और फिर देखा उसमें क्या था एंड इज अरो इट्स एनफ I can't bear it anymore. Oh God, again I have to eat sandwich. But he ate it. And then came Friday. He opened his lunch box and again he found what? Sandwich. He said, enough is enough. 
I can't bear it anymore. I think I have to finish my life. But again, he ate it. And then his friends who were watching him for the last four five days, they were very shocked. They thought the hell is happening. So they decided to help his friend, their friend, so they went. They said, "Why don't you go and talk to your wife?" He said, "You mind your own business and don't you dare bring my wife's name into this, because it's me only who packs my lunch." 